Uh, to me, the gist of this issue is about property rights. It's part of our country's foundations, and especially in the post-Kilo <clears throat> Kilo court ruling, many states have taken the affirmative action of redefining and revisiting their eminent domain statutes. The pipeline goes directly through the 62nd District, which includes parts of Owen County and parts of Scott County. And I think that we need to stand up to protect the constitutional rights of landowners. Uh, we have many numerous uh, concerned citizens in Scott County. Uh, you heard from one of them today, Ms. Cindy Foster, who spoke so eloquently on behalf of many concerned citizens. There are also citizens in my district who are happy with the arrangements and have signed willingly uh, to grant easements. But my family's been affected by eminent domain over the years. I-64 went through one of our family farms right here in Scott, uh, in Franklin County. Uh, the farm that my mother grew up on was taken completely away and now is part of the Northern Kentucky Cincinnati Airport. Those are bitter pills to swallow at the time, but it was for public benefit, public use, excuse me, and therefore I vote yes on this legislation.